Oh, it's still there. It's broken. I broke my clamp. <laughs> it is winter, it's cold, but it's not raining, and I didn't buy this 300L rally for it to sit in the garage. So up here, it's my favorite place to ride close to my house, surrounded by garbage, because people dump their damn garbage in the woods all over the place. This is why I like to get farther from civilization, because people are less likely to do this. So if you leave garbage out here like this, no one likes you. I want you to know that. But anyway, uh, it's about 4.15. I got about an hour of daylight, but I just wanted to come out and ride because it's not raining and it's supposed to start raining again tomorrow, I think. So a little bit of riding. I'm going to throw the 360 cam up and let's just go ride and explore. Maybe we'll check out the secret spot in the view and see how far we get before it starts getting dark. Thanks for coming along. Definitely a car on my road. I'm going the wrong way too, so I'm going to catch him. Hopefully they're not up here to murder innocent motorcyclists. That would be bad. Go we'll catch that car. Well, I don't want to be behind him, I know that. So we're just up here in the old stomping grounds. It's the only place I could get to before it got dark that I could get into the woods. And this is still that paved road, but we're on our way to the gravel. Hopefully we get there in time. Nice to check out the sunset maybe. I know a great spot for that. And uh, maybe even check on the secret spot. We'll see. We'll see. They're gonna be short on time, I know. It'd be nice to be home before dark, but at least out of the woods is my goal. There's the car, as predicted. That didn't take long. Hopefully they let us by. Generally they do up here when they notice you, which is not often. Yep, there we go. Wonderful. Wunderbar, that's wunderbar. Oh, thank you. Oh, that was a huge patch of ice. I don't know what the temperature is up here. Definitely cold, because look at all the ice. Definitely ice. So it hasn't gotten much above freezing today. Up here. Okay, I'm thinking I might call an audible and hit some gravel down below, so we know we'll get to it. No trails today, but it's just not... We just don't have time. We just don't have time today. I got maybe a half an hour of usable light, so let's just hit the gravel. And this gravel loops around to Crawfordsville and we can ride home on the road. That way we're at least headed out. We're not headed up where I gotta turn around. Here we go. Let's hit some gravel. Oh yeah, we got icy puddles. Fun. There's like an ice on the ground. That was an icy corner on this gravel. Everything's frozen. Good times, man. Good times. I don't want to screw up the camera, so I'm trying not to hit them too hard. Oh, this is my... Yeah, it's like muddy... Sli it's like, uh... It's legitimately frozen. Like, it's icy. Hilariously. I didn't expect that, did you? Not today, Satan. Ooh, let's break some ice. How icy is it? Oh, It's, uh, the ice is thick. Uh, I didn't even break through, so... Yeah! It's been frozen up here, man. It's been frozen up here. Alright, let's switch camera angles. I don't even know if the camera's hanging on back there. I don't like where it is. Hopefully it's still there. It cost me a lot of money. <clears throat> oh, shit. Oh, it's still there. It's broken. I broke my clamp. <laughs> well, okay. So the bottom of the thing broke off. Look. But it's held on by my pronghorn strap. Giant loop pronghorn strap for the win. Can you believe that? I didn't lose my camera. Did not lose my camera. Oh, I'm pretty happy I stopped. Pretty happy I stopped. I can't wait to see that footage. There's water inside the damn lens. What the hell? Wow. Wow, okay. That's stupid. I guess I'm just too hardcore for this. Huh? I guess I'm just too hardcore for this. You know what happens? Sometimes, you know, you're just hardcore and nothing can be done. 
Well, so much for using that today. I guess I can put it back on the handlebars. All right, well, that was a good test because we did almost nothing and this thing sucks. <laughs> okay, well, let's keep riding. Uh, we won't be doing any selfie stick action today, but let's get, uh, let's get what we can done for reasons. Fortunately, I have another selfie stick, but so much for the motorcycle kit, which is literally four motorcycles. Like, it's right there in the name. And uh, it sucks, I guess. Oh, it is literally icy slippery. I can feel it. That's hilarious. It is way more frozen up here than I anticipated. Well, I'm glad I didn't go ride the trails in because I would have been riding on ice. Yo. Oh, that one came out of nowhere. Okay. Good thing I closed my eyes because that's really good for riding. And it's not like I have a face mask or anything to protect me. Whatever. Human instinct is a weird thing. Do you remember, I don't know if you saw my video about sitting and standing when riding off road, but this is a perfect example of a road that you don't need to stand up on unless you feel sketched out. Or when I, if, if I was hitting those big puddles on purpose, I would stand up to let the suspension work. But since I'm just kind of avoiding them, um, it's perfectly acceptable to sit and just move the bike underneath you on terrain like this. Just being a little tentative because it's slippery weirdly slippery well if you're gonna ride this fast uh sitting down sitting down or standing up you got to cover the clutch and the brake two fingers on the clutch all the time because if that rear wheel starts to spin i will just pull it in or feather it really more accurately to uh give myself some traction reduce that wheel spin and keep going this road i remember the first time i came up here on the africa twin it scared the shit out of me it was i felt like it was so steep and scary it's crazy to rewrite things after a period of time and just see how different it feels like and really the, the, the terrain hasn't changed right just my skill has the rock quarries up here it's a decent view though worth stopping at since we're not going to get to the other one and then yeah i think we got to get down and get out because look the sun's going down you can tell yeah i love piss winding this thing it's so much fun Yep, here we go. Here we are. Oh, that's pretty. <laughs> Look at the mountains. Cool. I hope it's coming across on this camera. It probably isn't. But the Three Sisters snow-capped mountains right there in the distance. It's gorgeous. Beautiful with the sun just setting, touching the hilltops. Amazing. I have almost no time to enjoy it because I gotta go. Let's get the hell out of here before the sun goes down. Now, if you ride into these rock quarries, Anywhere with a fire pit like this, you got to be careful because people burn pallets and there's nails everywhere. So always try to just look where I'm going and never ride through the fire pit. Good times. Oh, cool tree. Also scary as shit. Look at that. Look at that. Look at it just hanging there. That's going to fall on the road at any minute. Look, it's just hanging by the branches. You see it's barely hanging on over there, so that, that trunk split. Fun. That's always fun to ride under. You're just like, is this the time? Is this the moment it goes? No? Okay, good. What a way to get freaking knocked off your bike. Wow, pretty. Gorgeous, man. Gorgeous. It's a bit of a gray area because this through road is open, and if there's no gate or sign, but at the same time, I know that this is not BLM. This is logging company land. Ooh, fun cutoff right there. I didn't see. It's hard to commit to a corner when you can't see how far it goes. You don't want to get caught sliding sideways and it's a, it's 180 degree or something and you just slide right off the edge. Not that fun. I imagine. Having never actually slid off the edge, I can't say for sure but uh, reasonably certain that, that would be not funny. And we're out. This is a short, short ride. This is the ending. So uh, I'm going to ride highway back because it's cold and it's getting dark and I need to get out of here, but I uh, just want to come out. Not even sure if this will be a video. Maybe I just got a bunch of B-roll footage. I don't know, but I want to get out and ride because um, it's winter and uh, that doesn't mean you can't ride. It just means riding is colder if you want to see more 300l videos better 300l videos in the future or to actually get out and do more stuff for more time because it won't be getting dark um 
please subscribe to the channel. Hit the like button if you want to see more 300L content or more content at all. Because I'm the dork in the road and I want to be your internet riding buddy. And I'm better than your regular riding buddies because I come with a mute button. Thank you for watching. And please do not forget to be excellent to each other. Oh, thank you. Excellent!